Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel and if you're new my name is Julie and I do handbag reviews and if you're not new welcome back it's so nice to have you guys so tonight I am going to talk to you about Longchamp specifically the nylon bags that they have in their um, ranges so there's four different lines that I'm going to talk to you very in depth about and um, it's going to be the original the club, the green line, and the Neo. And I have all my bags down here below. And so there's gonna be a little bit of the eye candy here going on as I describe each bag. But I want to um, call upon three YouTubers that have excellent Longchamp um, bag reviews on their channel. Joshi Michael is probably the first one that comes to mind because he's the one who really helps me get into Longchamp. Nick Snell, awesome. He loves um, a lot of the club bags. And then my friend Tesla. So I'm going to put all of their channels down below, linking their Longchamp videos too. So let's go ahead and just dive right in. I have got all these bags down here just hanging out. Again, there's four different lines being represented here in this video. So I'm not gonna do like a comparing of every single one, one at a time, but what I'm gonna do, I think what would be easiest is to just go in depth about each and every single line just across the board. Okay, so then at the very end of this video, you're gonna have a really good idea on, um, you know, if you're trying to figure out which line to buy from, which line you really like and which ones actually like suit your fancy um so so to speak so okay i'm gonna go ahead and start off first with the original so the original longchamp le pliages all have um brown leather trim okay they're all of course the regular longchamp nylon but they all have gold hardware and they also have cowhide leather trim and it's listed as cowhide on their website as you can tell like when you look closely it's kind of got a little bit of a pattern and now actually the new originals have two interior pockets so back in the day, well, I think it was just like changed this year, but now <clears throat> the new originals have a pocket in the very front, like they always have, and then something caught on where they started doing the back pocket now. So that's really handy. And in fact, when I bought this one just recently, I unboxed it for my birthday, I didn't realize that it was going to have that back pocket, so I'm like super excited that they added that. On all of the originals, all of them do fold. So they're going to have this button here on the back, um, which helps it, you know, collapse down and whatnot. So the originals are going to be the least expensive of the nylon offerings. So they, I know for the large long handle, which is extremely popular, that one retails in the US for 145. And then they kind of go down in price from there as you go to like the medium top handle and then this bag. So um, yeah, they're gonna be the least expensive on cost. But I really, really love the richness of the way the brown leather looks with any of the bodies of the nylon. They're just so pretty. And the other thing that is so pretty about the originals is this shiny gold hardware because you get the matching button to the um, gold zipper pull here. And then also with the originals, guys, the zipper teeth are just regular. So it's just the regular zipper teeth, very, very smooth. Um, you know, again, these bags have sharper corners so these ones with the nylon being a little bit on the just regular th scale they're not the thick neo nylon okay we'll get to that at the end but you know these ones can be prone to corner wear longchamp will fix for free your bag they're all about sustainability right now so they're all about making repairs which i love about the brand okay so this is the newly revised originals um, Longchamp in the nylon, okay? 
So that's that one. A few years ago, uh, Longchamp came out with the club line. So to break off from the originals, they wanted to be a little bit different and they came out with this really cool club line. The club line actually um, is cool because it features a matching leather trimmings to the body of the nylon. So every club bag will have a matching leather trimmings to the nylon. Same with the ears. These are called ears. That's what Longchamp calls them. Also, with the club, they have silver hardware. So it's going to have a silver zipper pull. Also, with the club, it's going to have, so you're going to have like the main body, okay? And then they always have an accentuated glazing color with that's going to match the horse and jockey and the button together, which is really beautiful. It just adds a little bit of a pop of a difference and so the bag's not totally solid so that really is cool the club version has always had a larger pocket in the back always whenever they first came out with this line that was the big draw was to have a larger like interior pocket my work bags are the club version and i really appreciate the large pocket because i always stick like my calculator and my pins in that back pocket and just it's really really nice for organization i'll say compared to like the old school original with that tiny pocket so this would be the club version they also have like great colors in the club version this color in particular is beautiful. It's called Antique Pink. I just recently picked this up from Nordstrom Rack on a super sale. So it's the small top handle club Antique Pink. So very fun. And I want to say this color, it's, it's hard to say what this color truly is, but I think it's actually a deep, deep navy which is stunning. It, yeah, it's actually deep, deep navy. At first I thought it was like a chocolate brown, which would have been really pretty with the pink, but. So, okay, that really kind of goes over the club. Oh, on the club pricing. So the pricing of the club is a tiny bit higher than the original. For instance, the original's long handle was 145, the club long handle is 155 in the US, so it's $10 more. So, and then they kind of break down, you know, and go a little bit less expensive as you go in a smaller size, okay? So, that is our overview of the club. Moving ahead to the most recent um, new line of bags in the nylon for Longchamp. This line came out five months ago, and it is the Le Pliage Green line which is so cool. It has a, um, Longchamp just basically wanted to give back and be more earth mindful. And all of the green line bags are made with recycled polyamide nylon. So basically everything that you see right here is a recycled bag from Longchamp. It's awesome. The way that they have brought about this line and being more care, caring for the earth is great. I'm all about that. Just the brand is just so good. And I was watching a video about a week ago about how they really want to focus on telling people that their bags can be repaired and they will repair your bags for free one time for you. If you just send it into them, they repair 60,000 bags a year guys. And that is awesome. They don't want to see bags go into the landfill. And so that's why they are so big on, you know, telling people to send their bags in to get repaired. It's just, I love it. I love this brand so much. So anyway, back to the green line. So the green line just recently came out. This is my small top handle in the color ocean. It is so pretty. They have many other colors in this line. Um, they have snow, which is white, beautiful. They have corn, which is um, a bag I have. It's in the yellow color. 
They also have Forest, which is a um, deep green color, Ocean, and then they have Red, and um, they also have this beautiful aqua color called Lagoon. <coughs> I'm gonna send, I'm gonna pop up all these pictures here so you guys can see on screen. So, but yes, they're all made with recyclable nylon. Now the leather, they said on the website it's actually Russian cowhide. I don't believe it's recycled. I don't know that for sure if the leather bits are recycled, but it is called Russian cowhide. Now. With all the green lines, it is the silver hardware, just like the club. And then here on the ears, they have hot green neon glazing. And that signifies that it is a green line bag. The cool thing too about the green line is it's like this horse and jockey is a little bit of a darker color that matches the leather. And then you have a silver matching button to the hardware. Very pretty. And just to kind of show you the inside of the green line bags, it's identical to the club, so it's gonna be just the one back pocket in the back, okay? So actually the originals has two pockets, which is interesting. And price. So on the green lines, I was looking at the pricing on the Longchamp website. They are in streamlined parallel with the club pricing. So for the long handled ones, $155. Really not much more money. This is in the United States. I don't know what other countries are doing, like if they're charging more for the green lines, but I know here in the US, um, the pricing is kind of on par with the club to the green. So, okay, this is the green line. We're going to go to the Neo. Okay, on the Neo. So, I wanted to also tell you guys to back up a little. The way this nylon feels is the same as the club and the original, okay? The nylon, even though it's made with the recyclable nylon, since it's made from other bags that are made at Longchamp, it's gonna feel the exact same, okay? It's the same thickness, same texture, and everything, okay? Next, for the Neo bags. So, on the Neo bags, this is gonna be at the top, as far as price point, for all the Longchamp nylon bags. This one right here is the small top handle with the crossbody strap, and it, it does include that nice adjustable crossbody strap. The small one does retail for $220. Um, it is a sturdier nylon, so it's just thicker. It's got a thickness to it. This nylon is more sleek. It's, it's silkier, it's satinier. The corners aren't gonna wear as bad. Now, it's gonna have these sharp corners again, and if you use this and use this daily for like two to three years, yeah, you're probably gonna get some corner wear. But, just so you guys know, the thickness of the Neo is, is more. There is no snap on the back of the Neo, which means you can't fold any of the Neo bags. Not even like the top, like the top regular, like long handled ones, those you can't fold either. But I think it's because this nylon is so much thicker that they didn't necessarily want people to snap these bag up, bags up, potentially. So, anyway, this is the small top handle with the long crossbody strap. The leather has more of a cross hatch pattern to it. It's a little bit different. I'm gonna compare that to like the original. You can kind of see. So there's the Neo to the original. See how it's a little bit different? So, and then also, sorry, you wanna focus. 
yeah. So it's a little bit of a different pattern there on the leather bits. And that continues through the handles as well. Um, the zipper teeth on the Neo. It's got silver hardware, first of all, and then it does have a silver button. The zipper teeth are huge. They're like really, really nice, chunky zippers and a buttery smooth zipper, of course. And then here you do have two pockets. You've got the one in the front and you've got the one in the back. So that is on all the Neos. So I really, really enjoy this style a lot because I love the versatility of having um, the capability of wearing the bag like on my side with a, with a shoulder strap. I do like that a lot. I do love top handle bags though too. But um, that's not even really part of the video, but I just wanted to show you, you know, the Neos. So also with the Neo top handle, they do have this nice elongated zipper pull here. So that's really kind of cool. And it's made with that same leather. It's a leather zipper pull. But that's pretty much it. Yeah, you know, this bag, it's well worth the price jump. It's gonna be quite a significant difference in price from, like, I think this one was 125 and this one's like 220, like I said. So it's, you know, $100 more, but you know, you're getting a thicker, thicker nylon and you're getting the strap. And now the straps again are adjustable, so that's really kind of cool. I have an LGP one that I bought like a year ago and I unboxed it here on the channel. It does not have the adjustable strap, but the, the new ones now do have an adjustable strap. So this is great that it does adjust. So guys, that pretty much concludes the in between all four of the nylon Longchamp lines. And um, I love each and every single one of them. I love them for different reasons. <coughs> I really, really love the look of the classic a lot because I think it just looks so pretty with the gold and the brown. It's just like a richness. And then I do think that everyone is really unique. I love the, ba the meaning of the green line. I think that that is such a cool, um, concept for the brand and just you know having a club bag is great because these ones you know are a whole different look because they've got silver hardware and they do have you know the different glazing on the handle so you know you just really can't go wrong with any of these so thank you guys so much for just checking out this chit chatty video and i'd love to hear what Longchamp bags you love that are in your collection. I just really enjoy chatting with you guys in the comments section. So feel free to like, subscribe, and um, I'm going to be doing a couple new. Here towards the end of the month, I'm going to do a uh, new LV comparison video for you, um, probably comparing speedy sizes. So that's going to be pretty exciting. So. Anyway, thanks guys. I hope you have a wonderful week ahead.